You doing okay? Simple things most of us take for granted, multiple sclerosis has simply taken from Leslie Pelick. Over the last eight years, she's developed severe shaking in her head and hands. So bad, in fact, look what happens when she tries to put a spoon to her mouth. Well, she couldn't feed herself before. I mean, she was losing weight. Uh, she was down to like under 100 pounds because she couldn't just get food into her mouth. But with the flip of a switch, doctors can help. Just look at the control Leslie has now. Touch your nose with that finger. What's making the difference for Leslie is a technique called deep brain stimulation. Surgeons insert a rod deep into a patient's brain, then run a wire just under the skin to a device that looks like a pacemaker. That device sends a mild electrical pulse to the brain, which settles the hands instantly. We're going to start stimulating now. In this remarkable video from the Ohio State University Medical Center, Dr. Adam Sarkar has just surgically implanted the device. But notice how much this man's hands are still flailing. Now he turns the device on and the shaking stops. A generation ago, doctors used to get similar results by burning parts of the brain, but this technology changes that. The stimulator allows you to place an electrode, not destroy the brain, and see if it works. And if it works, great, and then everyone's happy. And if it doesn't work, well, then you just pick up stakes, pull out, and you haven't really lost much. But for Leslie, it is working and giving her back at least some control. It's been a significant change, and I'm looking forward to the future to get even better. At Ohio State University Medical Center, this is Clark Powell reporting. Right through that door. Straight ahead.